Hi, my name is Vladana, and I will take you through the platform and show you the most important tools and functionalities. I'm part of the customer success team, and my colleagues are Jill and Kareem, who you might already be familiar with. We work closely with the account management team, making sure you gain the maximum value from your access, understand how to navigate the platform to its full potential, and analyze the data you're presented with. I'll start by showing you the home page. Here you can see the world map and the countries that are part of your subscription. This is the default view, meaning that no filters have been selected yet. This means that at this moment, the number for each country in the map represents the total number of projects for the country in question. It includes both active and inactive projects, the ones under execution, pre-execution, but also projects that are completed, put on hold, or canceled. These numbers will change to reflect your active view and the selected filters. On the right-hand side, under New and Updated, you'll find two lists, Projects Created, a list that includes projects that were recently added to the platform, and Projects Updated, showing you recently updated project profiles. Now, I'll switch to Projects tab to show you how you can filter and search for projects based on different criteria. You'll find a set of filters on your left-hand side. Here, I will select the most important filters, which are location, sector, and stage and status. Location allows you to select the project's country and also gives you the possibility to break the selection down to regions and cities. Next, you can choose the sector and be more specific by selecting the subsector. Stage and status allows you to focus on specific stages within the project. Now we're ready to generate our list of projects and save it. First, click Apply to get the list of projects. Based on the filters I've selected, the list includes oil and gas projects in the UAE that are currently under execution. To save this list and the combination of filters, I'll click Create Saved Search and Alerts. Creating and saving a search is a very important step for several reasons. The combination of filters you selected will be saved on the platform so that next time when you log in, you don't have to apply the same filters again. After naming the search, you can share it with other users from your company. This will allow you to align your project list and work in a more collaborative way. Third important step is setting up the email alert. Email alerts will enable you to stay on top of all project updates and you'll be able to identify new projects and opportunities on the market. You can select the frequency of updates and the type of content you want to be notified about. By selecting the first option, you will receive an email whenever a new project is added to your saved list and also whenever an existing project in the list is updated. To save your search and alerts, click Confirm and Save. You'll find your newly saved search under Saved Searches filter. There is no limit to how many you can create and save which means you can have saved searches dedicated to specific sectors, regions, and stages. You will find a complete list of saved searches under My Account tab, Manage Saved Search. First list is the list of saved searches that you created, and the second list includes saved searches that other users from your company shared with you. If you want to edit alerts that you've set up for your saved searches, you can click on Manage Alerts. Here you'll find a list of saved searches for which you set up alerts. By clicking on Edit Alert, you can change alert preferences and email frequency. This is also from where you can delete your saved searches. From the generated list of projects, by clicking on the star next to a project's name, you can add a project to your favorites list and you can at the same time share the project profile with other users from your company. This is a great way to highlight new projects and opportunities to your colleagues. You can also activate email alerts for the project in question by clicking the envelope. By doing this, you will not miss any important project updates, such as stage changes, tenders, contract awards, etc. To view the list of projects you marked as favorites, go to My Account, Manage Favorites. Here you'll find a list of project and company profiles that you marked as favorites, and also lists of profiles that other users shared with you. To edit the alert for a particular project, 
Go to the project's profile page and click the arrow on the right side. You can set up a new alert here or edit the existing one.